Hello everybody, my name is Gather Moore. Welcome back for another video of Assassin's Creed Odyssey. We're gonna continue this series, boys. Um, I wanted to quickly thank you, all of you, for your support, your enormous, tremendous, uh, tremendous, uh, tremendous, your enormous, tremendous love that you gave me throughout the last videos, and especially the last one. I mean, the last one got s all the way to 7,000 views, boys. I don't know if it's gonna stay that way with the algorithm with YouTube or something because sometimes YouTube is weird but I love you guys so much you guys uh, mean a lot to me and um, really wanted to thank you for your support keep at it man keep at it, it makes me want to do, do more videos that's for sure it makes me want to uh, do more time for you guys that's for sure so keep at it I love you guys thank you so much right now we're just just trying to do these two missions right here. We got two other priests to talk to, I guess. What is this other mission right there? I should be uh, careful. It's in the center. Uh, get information from the priest. Okay. So I guess we got more priests to talk to. We, we got to do a couple of side quests in order to... I guess they're going to give us uh, some side quests, the uh, priest. The last one wasn't that... Um, that long actually so we'll see if these are uh, longer greetings young one come to offer us clipios a sacrifice no but i'm searching for a spartan mother who may have the great goddess ira guides many mothers to the sacred place surely i'm too feeble to remember them all what are these stone slabs for? These are uh, records. We document all who pass through, uh, their illnesses, treatments, so that the glory of Asclepios can be celebrated. Then I don't need your memory. I just need to find the right stone. Um, yes, of course. That's very wise indeed. If only I had the time to help you, I will hurt you. My mother came through. Not afraid to. I'm not, I'm going to do the menace, boys. Me to I'm going to treat uh, tread them because I don't want to waste too much know. time here. Please, it's Chrysis. She said that anyone who talks to the eagle bearer will be paying a visit to Hades. Then don't talk. Just bring me to the stone that can. Follow me then. Quickly. We must be discreet. Lead the way. All right then. So he'll simply just. All right, we'll do that. There we go. We'll follow him. He's gonna lead us to an old stone that can actually tell us. What kind of sanctuary? Tell us what we need to to need. What we were searching for, I guess. Right now, it looks like all the priests can't talk. They're being controlled by the cult or something like that. So they can't talk in anything or anything. It's just me, boys. He talks very low. It's unbelievable. Can barely hear. I can barely he hear him on my screen. I'm sure you guys can't. Can barely hear him as well. Blind woman who had her eyes licked by snakes. It reads, of Sparta. Came here with child. Sought pity from the gods. Why is most of it scratched out? Oh, uh, I'm. I know this one by heart. The Spartan woman arrived filthy and bleeding from her troubles. We cared for her, gave her food, a bath, and she left. Where she went, I do not know. The child could not be saved. Who does know where she went? We've been spotted. Meet me later, near the olive tree of Heracles, at the entrance of the sanctuary. I may have something for you. And what do we have here? A priest and a mercenary out for a friendly stroll? May the gods be with you, Plistos. I was just on my way to the archives when this Mystios bumped into me. Is that so? And what were you both chatting about so fervently, might I ask? We were talking about my mother. We were talking about sword wounds. I was looking for the bathhouse. Um, you know what? 
I'll tell the truth this time around. We were talking about sword wounds. We're talking about my mother. I'm looking for my mother, a Spartan woman who came through here. This kind priest brought me to this stone. It could be hers. I am um, have to. There's something. I must be going. We treat the sick, eagle bearer. And we respect the privacy of those we treat. Now please leave. Your presence can only cause harm. See, I prefer telling the truth right there. So we gotta meet the guy. The old man, the, uh, the olive tree. So I guess we'll do that. We'll do that right away, boys. Hopefully it's going to tell us what we exactly need to know because I don't want to have to search forever for other priests and do a couple of side quests. If that's the case, I'm going to have to like, just skip the, these parts or something because this is getting long, boys. It's getting long. I feel like these are not really a main mission. It's like a hidden main mission, basically. Or it's not really one, but it says it's one for some reason. Mercenaries? Okay, I don't, I don't care about that. So there it is, right here. Is he gonna be there? I'm not sure if it's loved more for its legend or its olives. He knew the penalty for speaking with the eagle bearer about her. Crisis was clear. You didn't have to kill him. But we did, and now we'll kill you. Oh, I guess they killed him. They killed the priest. So I, I won't know anything. Forgot I should have lied, maybe. I don't know if it would have made any like difference or anything. I doubt it, boys. We're gonna kill these dudes anyways. These guys think they're really smart attacking me like that. Honestly, they're not. It's like, come on now. What the hell? What is this? Oh, God. Okay, I don't even know what this mercenary was doing right here. She's just running around and all of a sudden I start attacking her by accident. Of course she's gonna attack me back, but what the hell was she doing here? Okay, let's attack them boys. No you don't. Okay, let's get him. No you don't. There we go, attack her. Mercenary is gonna die in a second boys. There we go, mercenaries dead. The amount of mercenaries I killed, they're not that difficult actually in this game, boys. Well, there are a challenge, but looks like I, I'm really the best one there is. I'm not really playing as a mercenary anymore. I'm more like... I'm on the side of the... I'm more playing like an assassin more than anything, boys. Looks like because... I'm not saving people, but... I'm not like doing things for money either so kind of in the middle so what what are we going to do now because the priest can't tell us anything it looks like doesn't look like we know anything alrighty then so since we don't know anything I guess the only thing to do left is this one which we gotta go look for the um, for another one of these priests right here is apparently over there so let me go ahead and travel over there with my horse let's see what this priest right now the, the i hope this is the last one at least has to say about my mother hopefully we finally have the answers because we didn't have any answers so far N no real good answers at least may asclepio spare her from suffering will she live not unless the gods heed our prayers. Many sick Athenians have arrived in Argolis recently, and very few have left. This poor girl has the same sickness. I want to help. I want information. I don't care about the sick. I'm looking for information about the Spartan woman who came through here. I was warned about an ego bearer, a ruthless killer he was called. Do you think it's wise to deny this ruthless killer the information he desires? Healing the sick is my path. Help me get the attention of the gods, and I tell you what I can. What are you asking, exactly? Her illness seems to have no cure, 
and is spreading. Our sacrifices have done little to draw the attention of the gods. Pigs, goats, all have fallen on deaf ears. We need the beast whose blood will ignite these flames for Asclepios to see. What did you have in mind? There is a rumor of a bull with skin as white as snow roaming the sanctuary outskirts. Head west of here, towards the coast. Bring it to me alive and will offer a sacrifice the gods cannot ignore. Oh my god. Why do I have to do all this? Why don't you just tell me? Like, for God's sake, why Why are they so afraid? The worst that can happen to them is die, like the other priests. There's, it's nothing. Come on now. The outskirts are vast. Let Last me I just skip that because these are just um, bonus, bonus stuff that helps me out in the search. So help the priest get information about Mirin. Track the quest. There we go. Secret bull in Agris. Now he's over there, so let's go ahead and track him down, boys. So I think we have arrived, boys. Uh, find and bring the sacred bull. I think this is it right there. So let me just dismount. Go in here. Now there might be people in here. Yes, there is. Of course, it's uh, some sort of temple and stuff, so there's going to be a lot of soldiers. What's going on here? There's like a fight already going on. What the hell's going on? Let me kill these guards. Um, I can probably find a way to get the bull. Yeah. Oh, it's because a lion's actually attacking them. That's funny as hell, boys. There we go. We're good. Let's take it. And bring the bull back. Okay, that's it. Well, that was easy, boys. That was like the most simple thing ever just have to go to a direction get a get the skin and i guess bring it back that was super easy let's just go back then we don't have i don't even have to transition it's not that far away actually like uh you go super fast with this horse all right let us go boys uh, we'll jump right here and there it is there it should be the priest let's give him that finally he's gonna give us the information i can't believe like Please it's been it's it took us so long to have just a little bit of information boys did you find the white bull i couldn't bring it back alive but i did manage to collect its heart this won't be enough to please asclepios the beast died unwillingly and with just a heart, we'll only be able to pray for one life. Please, Mythios. The white bull you killed was mine. My farm feeds half of our lease. If I die, people will starve. I beg you. My husband was killed by the sickness. I have two small children. Who will take care of them if I die? I am wealthy and will pay you for this blessing. <coughs> it's okay. Give the sacrifice to them. You did this. You choose whose prayers get heard by the gods. Really? The girl? The wealthy woman? Or the farmer? The wealthy woman? She'll pay me. Come on, now I'm a mercenary. I'm a mystios. I'm gonna choose the wealthy guy. The wealthy person. God bless you, mystios. My children, thank you. You'll pay for this. It will be done. The rest is in the hands of the gods. I did my part, priest. The Spartan woman you're after. You've met her? Her visit to the sanctuary is legendary. But sadly, it was before my time. The man you want is Midon, the elder priest. He spoke of her often. That is, before he cut out his tongue. Cut out his tongue? When he's not healing the sick, he's in the guest house. Spends a lot of time being tended to by the servants. <sighs> Thank you. I won't forget you helped me. And these people won't forget you helped them. See, we already knew that. Another, the first priest already told us about Midden, boys. So this is the this is the thing right here. We already knew about Midden. Why did we just go right after him? Did we just? Did we just need to know exactly where he was? Is that where it is? So, Midden, we're going to talk to him. 
Uh, this girl looks like it's not gonna pay me right now. I hope she paid me. She didn't pay me. I'm gonna kill her, boys. I'm gonna come back and kill her. Because I swear, I need my money. I would have prayed for the girl instead if she doesn't give my money. The former, I just didn't care. I mean, it's a bull, it's a bull. Come on now. You can give another, you can get another bull. Don't worry about it. Interrogate Midden, the Elder Priest. Is he gonna finally know what we're after? Now, of course. He's protected. Or more or so guarded, I should say. But uh, nothing that we can't manage, boys. There we go. Nothing that we can't manage. Kill this guy. This guy's not dead. There we go. He's dead. Oh, this other guy saw me. Okay. Well, you're gonna be dead in a second, my guy. Let's just kill the, uh, the captain right here. Once he's dead. There's some more soldiers? How many? God damn. Not that they're, uh, they're really special or anything, but... It's getting annoying, man. I just want to talk to someone. Come on. Let me talk to the priest. Where are you all coming from? You weren't there a second ago. You're annoying. Get out of here. Not even that serious. Let's go. Let's talk to Midden, boys. doesn't speak so I've heard I'm here to find out why Chrysis did this to him uh -huh. I thought he did this to himself to prove his loyalty to her now why would Chrysis want an elder priest to cut out his tongue Midon is a caring generous man I want answers from him not you tell me about the Spartan woman and her baby he can only answer yes or no. All right then. Was the uh, was the woman's name Mirin? The Spartan woman. Was her name Mirini? It is. It was. Was the baby hers? They said she had a baby with her. Was it hers? The All right. The baby was close to death when they arrived. Midon prayed for its life. Did I tell you to talk, lady? Did Marion say where she was going? Did she tell you where she was going? Okay, so she d he doesn't know where she went. Is this girl your sir? Uh, uh, you saved the baby? You saved the child. He didn't. No. He did everything he could, but the baby was badly wounded. So the baby died. So there we had a day. She had a third child. That's uh, interesting. We are three. There's three of us. Is this girl your servant? Do all sanctuary priests take their servants to bed? I am not his servant. We share a sacred bond. Sacred? <laughs> right. Right. Yeah. All right. I know why you cut out your tongue. Yeah, exactly. I know why Chrysis made you cut out your tongue. The night my mother brought my sister here, you and your priests left her for dead. And Chrysis didn't like you telling the story. That's not what happened! What do you know? You're too young to have been there. He told me the story many times before that witch stole his voice. He tried to save the baby, did everything he could. Believe you, dead. How can my baby be dead? I don't know what to tell you. You were lucky she survived as long as she did. That that fall was devastating. <laughs> my baby. My baby. <laughs> Listen, there's nothing we can do for you anymore. You'd best be on your way. Ray is here. <laughs> They're gone. They're both gone. He 
wept for that Spartan woman so far from home. Her baby barely recognizable, hardly breathing. Shut up. PC should have had your tongue cut out. I want answers. Exactly. Someone was actually there that night. Chrysis took the baby, didn't she? And she made you cut out your tongue to hide the truth. Where is Chrysis? So now you want to hear what I have to say. Don't test me. Speak. There is an altar where people offer their sick babies to be healed. This is where she took the child. Find it near the statue of Apollo Maleatas and you'll find Chrysis. People come to this sanctuary to heal. But I come here and find people dying without hope. Priests without tongues. And babies left with an insane woman. My mother was a fool to trust any of you. I'm going to find Chrysis. And she's going to pay for what she's done. Oh, she's gonna pay, alright, boys. She hid Hush the baby child. all this time around. May there we go, Chris. Is one of them, the cultist, of course. So there she is, right here. She should not have done that. She's gonna pay really hard, boys, to have hidden the baby and everything. So let's just go ahead and do the site. Uh. We don't have any more quests. So I think it's gonna probably drop out. I must find this altar of Apollo Maliatas. So this is just another one of these things. Hashes to hashes, new quest. The altar. Find uh and reach the forest of altar. There we go. So apparently she's in there. Um she's highly probably in there. In the forest. If we can find her. Not kill her. But badly wound her just to get information out of her and then kill her because we need to kill the cults anyway. The cults, the uh, uh, partners, and everything, uh, anyway. So we need There's to call, the uh, kill them. We'll do that after information, but we need the, to get the information first, boys. We need to know. She hid all this information from us. And why did she take the baby? Why did she take her and get her into a cult? That's just nonsense right there. It's just crude. That's that's just crude right here. They should have um, get it, give her give There's it back. There's the statue of Apollo and the altar. Okay, let's see Chris, what we got. A warning. Must be getting close. It's a fair warning, I guess. Killing an eagle. Just because we represent the eagles, boys. It's not gonna happen, boys. Elder crying baby. What? Oh, that's weird. Will help, I guess. Don't know who's in there. It's like it's some sort of temple right here, boys. All alone in itself, by itself. That's strange. That is uh, really strange right here. All you cultists will die. Really now? <laughs> That was not a smart idea from you to attack me right here, lady. You don't want to do that. All right, you know what? If you want to play it that way? Fine. We're gonna, I'm gonna attack you. I'm gonna kill you. And you're gonna, you're gonna regret the day you chose to do a sneak attack on me. There we go. And. You're dead. Only two guards to to uh, protect uh, to protect her, which is uh, kind of ridiculous. Killing seems to run in your bloodline, Almighty oh Eagle Bearer. Don't you dare speak of my family, Snake. I still remember the night your mother brought me my child, the sad, pathetic thing, crying in the rain. Had I known then that Mirini had two children, but here you are, my family is complete. You let my mother believe her baby was dead. But she was. Oh, how your mother wept when that little heart stopped beating. 
but then I took care of her, placed her on this very altar, screamed for the gods to spare her life, and they listened. What happened to my sister exactly? What I need did to you know. Do with my sister? I saved her life by teaching her to suffer, to know pain so well that she would learn to welcome it like an old friend. And now she will teach all of the Greek world to know that pain. You tortured her? She was just a baby. I taught her to survive. This world is cruel. It demands strength or death. So I gave her strength. And where's my mother exactly? Where did my mother go that night? That weakling crawled to the hills of Corinth. The monger was supposed to deliver her back to me, but she can't hide forever. She will give us more children. I'll kill I'll you now. I've got what I needed. For the pain you've caused. <laughs> this world is pain. I gave Demo strength to go. Your mother was a weakling who whined to the gods like a pig on an altar. I am more a mother to her child than she will ever be. I can be a mother to you too, Eagle Bearer. This goes beyond my family. You and your cult are going to destroy the Greek world. You bring nothing but suffering. You talk of suffering, and yet you come drenched in blood and threaten my life. You are a killer, just like your sister. Here, let me show you. Fuck that. I'm after her. Fuck the baby, boys. Let's get her. Now I gotta heal myself up because of the, the fire. She, she got uh, attacked by some lions too. Fuck the baby, boys. I don't care about the baby. I'm here to kill her. You're dead. You fucking snake! <laughs> you call me snake, yet you took two lives tonight. The infants are now mine. I'm proud of you, my child. I will find my family. I will find my family. I am not your child. I will find my mother, and we will be together again. I will make this right. This is for my mother and every family you destroyed. What Too much of a quick death for you, that's for sure. There's another cultist down, boys. That's a good thing in itself. Now, Mr. Lion, please don't. There we go. You shouldn't have attacked me. So, abandoned by the gods. New quest. Return to Addings. Oh, all right. Got to do that. Let's see. Look at the quest, I guess. This is the only one. Yeah, it is. Looks like it is, boys. So, cultist, of course. Um, killed her. Now, it looks like we got some information about this one right here. Just a little bit. A quick save. No, okay. We got some little bit of information. What about the others? Okay, no, we don't have any more information about the others. Okay. All right, boys. We got a long ways to go, though. So many cultists to, to kill. That's uh, that's gonna be rough. Let me just get that. There we go. Inventory. We're gonna look at the inventory. I'm going to just fast travel to Adin's boys. I'll see you once I'm there. What's going on? Talk to Aspasia. Hell just happened. 
my question is now that we're back into addings boys and that we kind of know what all we needed to know uh, as to well where my mother might have been like current which is really close to addings we might we might not need her or Ericless anymore so can we kill Ericless so I can uh, get the Spartans over here in Athens. Can that happen or is that never gonna happen in the game? Alexios, you're back. Gotta run, sorry. Wait, where? I'll be right back. See you at Sometimes I think you are too much like me. What is she talking about? Where did she go? Or would she... So Kratos and Cleon might have some information on the situation. We gotta talk to Sir Kratos. Talk to them, boys. Don't know what's going on here. What's going on, Sir Kratos? What's going on here? Aspasia. Oh, Alexios, you've returned to Athens. What's left of Athens? The world we've built is crumbling at our feet. It's not looking good. We have to hold it together. It's not looking good. It's as loud as a battlefield out there and as violent. They're calling for Pericles' head as though he should know how to handle this catastrophe. No one is prepared for the end of the world. I came to talk to you. I found out some things about my mother, her name, her ship. Alexios, it's not the time. Pericles is dying. He won't see me. He won't let Hippocrates in his room. He only babbles about going to his precious Parthenon. I need to talk about Marin. I don't care about Pericles. I really don't. I'm all I'm here for was from the beginning for my mother. I don't care about the Athenians. The reason I came back to Athens was to talk to you about Marini. Your mother will live to see tomorrow. My love won't live to see another sunset. You've had many sunsets with him. I've spent all my nights alone. <sighs> Pericles needs treatment, and the gods know he won't let me in. He respects you. Could you go to him? I could try. If you do, I will make the time to talk about your mother. For now, he needs your help. It's worth a shot. For God's sake, man. Don't want to talk to him. Alright, I think we're going to do this in the next video, boys. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Remember to keep a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video, boys. Keep it easy.